Like, most definitely isn't finished. Whoa, drift it. Oh, boy, we're drifting a bus. We're actually drifting a bus. That was amazing. Alrighty, hello guys, welcome to faces back to another Stormworks video. Hopefully this one's going to be a little bit more interesting than the previous one where we tested out a bunch of vehicles. Uh, but this one is going to start with this, the Mark 1 balloon plane. Uh, I just thought it looked weird, so I figured we'd test it out. Anyway, we're going to quickly jump into this thing. We'll fly it around, we'll probably land it, and then we'll check out something else. So, let's go ahead and jump in and uh, get going. Alright, so first issue. I don't actually know how to get into this thing. I, I'm assuming that we can jump high enough to get to the seat, but like, I can't. <laughs> I don't know how to get into this thing. Can we get in from underneath? No. How do we get inside? That is an issue. I, I genuinely don't know how to get onto this thing. You know what? I'm gonna have to- I'm gonna have to edit the vehicle slightly so that we can actually get onto it. So we just need a- just- just need some stairs, actually, to the side of it, and then we can jump on. Okay, this should be high enough. I'm not entirely sure, though, but, um, yeah, it, it should be. Look at it. We can just jump on here, jump on here, yep, jump on this bit, and then jump on- oh, I missed. Okay. Wow. Alright, let's try that again. Just jump on all of these things, yes. And then we jump across, we sit in the seat, and we can go. Alright, throttle up. Key on, heater, brakes, ignition, ignition, what does the key do? If we've got ignition. Oh, we broke it. We broke it straight away. We've broken this split. Look at it. <laughs> it's so weird looking. I figured we'd do a fair fight. So, uh, we're, or a fair flight, I should say. Uh, so we're going to try and take off this way. Here we go. Try and take off again. Let it gain some speed. Hopefully don't break it this time. And we are in the air. Oh, look at it go. <laughs> it's so weird. It is a really weird looking plane. I like it though, and it seems to work. So, um, yeah, why not? Why not? All right, so the interesting part about this, I mean, there's lots of interesting parts about this, um, is that we're gonna have to land like this, um, because I don't know whether we've actually got proper controls uh, on the seat itself. Anyway, we're not going to fly back over to the multiplayer island. We're going to fly straight over to the Isle of Donk. And we're going to... Oh my. I just spotted the thing. I just spotted the cave thing. We're, we're going to fly through it. We're going to... There it is. There, we're going to try and fly through it in our... In our balloon plane. Dude, this... It's so stable. It's weird. This is very strange. I like it. We might have to design something like this in the future. But wow. Okay, for just now, this is cool. This is super cool. I like it. I love it. Can we fit through there? The last time I tried to fly a plane through here, I was trying to do it upside down, and um, yeah, that that didn't go well. Not gonna lie, that that really didn't go well. Uh, but this this is looking way more promising. This plane actually seems really stable, so we can fly straight through here. Um, of course, the plane doesn't really have a purpose. It doesn't really serve a purpose at all. Um, but it's so easy to fly. Look at that, straight through there. We're gonna go land on the airfield now. And everything's going to be A-OK. -okay. Awesome. All right, here we go. So uh, we're going to have to throttle down using the thing on the inside, which is is fine. That's OK. We can totally do that. Um, but of course, we're going to have a few problems because we need to we need to slow down a bit. And uh, we can't really do that. Not really. What's the other button down here? Brakes. Oh, we do have brakes. All right, cool. Here we go. We're going in for a landing. Cut the throttle completely. And we've bounced once. And we're on the ground. Okay, fantastic. All wheels are on the floor, so brakes on. And we have landed. Yeah, we have. Look at that. That's epic. That is actually a Wait, the brakes. Do I have to hold the brakes? I guess I have to hold them. But there we go. We landed. Right, let's check something else out. If you want to use this, I'll link it below. Dude, look at this little thing. This is actually super cool looking. So this is called the Storm 2. Storm 2. Look at it. It's even written on the side. And it's got a date on it. Wow. Um, but yeah, I don't really know what this is for. I don't know what type of boat this is. Um, but we're going to go ahead and sit in the seat. Whoa, it's got lots more things back here than I thought. Uh, so we've got what this? Display next, which it has a map. It has a radar. And it's got this, which is a consumption um, thing. Okay, cool. We got low charge. Wait, we got low charge. What, already? We haven't done anything. 
Okay, well, nav lights. Okay, cabin lights. Yes, sure. Uh, we got the switch, we got engine RPS, and we got engine power. A our ignition is on one. Oh, it's also here. Okay, interesting. And we're already moving. Okay, good. Engine RPS, let's boost it. All the way. Oh, dude, this is faster than I thought it was going to be. Okay, awesome. Uh, so we got these spotlights on the front, which are orange. And we've also got a spotlight on the side. Not sure how much that helps. Um, but we're flying. We're really going for it. That's cool. Um, how about we do a mission with this thing? All right, we got a downed helicopter. Let's go ahead and make our way over there. It's like seven kilometers away. Uh, the outboard motors are... I mean, they're kind of cool, but at the same time, if we turn too hard, one of them gets out of the water and then we sort of roll. Um, but I think it sort of fixes itself a little bit with that. So, um, yeah, I think we'll be fine. We'll be completely fine. If you uh, want to know how fast this thing is going, it's going 98 kilometers an hour. Okay, KPH. Um, what is this? The RPS max is 16. I think we're currently at 11. I'm not not entirely sure how to read this. Um, but yeah. Oh, no, we're at 6. Max is 16? Okay, right, okay. What is the 11? What does the 11 mean? I'm not sure. Uh, but that's okay. What is this? Liters per hour, 3,500. Liters per 100 kilometers, 3,600. Okay. And fuel, we've got 1, uh, 2,683. So we don't actually have enough to go 100 kilometers. Interesting. Not at this speed, at least, but we might be able to change that. That's interesting. Uh, light. Wait. Searchlight move. Oh, you can actually point it up and down. That one. Ah, interesting. How do we turn that on? Oh, there we go. That was easier than I thought it would be. Can I get out my seat? Yes. Oh, and we got a winch back. What is this? Temperature. We can check the temperature of the engines. Aha. Interesting. Right. Well, blinker yellow. Is that above? Where's the blinky? Where's the blinky light? Is that above? I don't think jumping while moving this fast is a good idea, but, you know, I had to try. All right, we are getting close to the accident now. So, um, it is a helicopter crash, as you guys can see. Uh, how do I actually slow down? Max engine... Oh, okay. W and S is for actually going forwards and backwards. Uh, oh, the engine RPS, I should say. Backwards is uh, reverse, which is here. Okay, whoa! Okay, right, we flew past them. Let's go ahead and turn around. Woohoo! There we go. The outboard motors don't actually turn. Um, they've got little rudders on them, which is, I guess, an alright way of doing it. Uh, but let's go ahead and stop next to these guys. We'll jump out, we'll grab them all out of the ocean, and we should be fine. Alright, follow me, follow me, follow me, and grab that one. There we go. Everybody ready to jump on board? Hopefully they can all jump on. They can't, because they're dummies. You big dum-dums. Come here, you. That one was underneath the water for a second. And we'll grab you as well, put you there. Awesome. Um, okay, should we try and tow the helicopter? It might be a bad idea. Probably a bad idea. Uh, in fact, it's definitely a bad idea. Um, but it's okay, don't worry. Stationary connector? Don't know what that means. Don't know what that means at all, but if we jump under... Where is it? Where, 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 where is it connected to? I don't really know. Where, where is it connected to? I'm a tad confused. Is that it right there? I think it might be attached on via magnet already. Uh, maybe? Is it? I can pick it up now. Okay, I don't know what it was connected by. Um, but okay, let's go ahead and jump over here. We don't have anything to connect it to the helicopter by, but we can put it in the helicopter, close the door, and then we can just pull it along. Yeah, this might work. Uh, at the same time, it might not, and it doesn't matter if it doesn't. So, um, yeah, let's just go. Also, the bu Whoa, Jesus. Probably don't want to do it that quickly. It came straight through. Never mind. Right, we're out of here. It is worth noting, though, that the um, the boat actually stayed on while we were in the water there, which is perfect. I love when things like that happen. Yeah. Uh, right, where are we? How far away are we? We are 1.4, 1.5 kilometers away, and everybody is fine. Okay, so let's just say, I don't know, it was bad weather. Like, quite bad, really bad weather. Um, how does the boat handle? The boat flies a little bit, but it hasn't tipped over yet. Okay, let's go ahead and go into the waves. Yep. I think it's got some sort of stability system in it. 
that works really well. Is it? I don't think it's going to tip over. That's awesome. Yeah. It like it looks like it's going to, but then it never does. Yeah. Awesome. Oh, I should totally um pull that thing back in too. I have jumped out of my seat. Uh, don't worry about that. Winch up. Here we go. Yeah, everything's fine. Don't worry. Everything is completely fine. Okay, let's go ahead and turn all of these off. And it should connect back too. I am I am holding... <laughs> Look at this. Oh, I'm swimming. Okay, right, I'm going to get back in my seat. Because that is dangerous. That is so dangerous. Oh, oh, we almost tipped there. That was close. I, was, I think it's fine though. I, it doesn't look like it's actually struggling at all. And we're getting up to speeds of like 130. Well, we're flying currently. Okay, right, let's go ahead and turn that back down because uh, it's a little bit too dangerous for me. A little bit too dangerous. Go ahead and turn all those off. Good. And we will uh, stop right here. There we go. Perfect. Oh, that's awesome. Right, jump out the seat. You jump out the seat. You jump out the seat. And you follow me, follow me, follow me. And we can just walk around. Don't fall off. That one fell off. You're a dummy. Oh, they all fell off. Okay, they're all dummies. Come here. There we go. We got one. We've got two. Where's the other guy? There's... Oh, really? Really, really? She jumped off again. Stop it. I hate the AI in this game. I really do. Anyway, follow me. We're going to deliver all these dudes. Is it following me? Yeah, he is. All right, cool. Get up the ladders, which are massive. Okay, put that there. Grab the dude. Follow, follow, follow. And we'll sell them. Yeah. Okay, I don't condone selling people to hospitals. But um, when you got to get money, well, uh, that's just what happens. Wait, where are they? They don't want to go in the hospital. Hey, come with me. I'm money selling you. They'll look after you. Don't worry. I didn't even realize there was bunk beds here. Can they go in them? <gasps> you could go in the top bunk bed. That's amazing. We got 12 and a half grand. More than 12 and a half grand. Wow. Them some expensive people. Okay, so we figured out that this boat can actually deal with quite a lot of things. So if you guys want to check that out, I'll link it down below. All right, so we did a plane, we've done a boat, and now we're doing a land vehicle. Look at this. The Edmonton Transit System. Uh, it's a bendy bus. We've actually got... How do I get in? How do I get in? Does that door not open? Is it impossible to get... I, I don't... Uh, door three? Wait, I can open the doors from the seat. I've opened one of the doors. The back door. Okay, right. Well, we can get in here. Cool. Okay, so we got a bunch of seats. We can go through the bendy bit and we can get to the front. Nice. Whoa, things are breaking in here, but that's fine. Don't worry. Um, so, toggle button. Don't know what that does. Toggle button right here. Don't know what that does. Throttle levers. Again. Don't really know what that does. We're driving backwards. We are going backwards. We went backwards. Okay, don't worry. Everything's fine. Why is it making that noise? Where am I? Okay, we've managed to turn around. Interesting. Okay. Everything's fine. Everything is completely fine. Okay, we're going to do a lap of the runway and everything will be a-okay I hope oh dude I don't think this is finished I really don't think this is finished okay so uh the indicators come on when we press left or right so that's pretty cool if we press one we get whoa we get the lights on the front if we press two we get the other lights okay and if we press three we get H what is H uh okay three three doesn't actually appear to do anything how fast are we going Oh god, I can't tell. I don't know what's going. What's even hap- This definitely isn't finished. Like, most definitely isn't finished. Whoa, drift it. Oh boy, we're drifting a bus. We're actually drifting a bus. That was amazing. That was so cool. Alright, we've drifted it. And now we're heading back. Okay, this, this thing definitely isn't finished. Uh. Oh, it's so broke. Okay, right. Whoa. Everything's fine. Don't worry. We're going to park up and we're going to leave it here because holy bejesus, this is scary. 
This is actually quite scary to be in. Window? Okay, cool. Uh, let's go ahead and slow it down to a stop. I can't. Okay, fantastic. Oh, there we go. Now we're at a stop. Beautiful. Brakes can go on. Okay, good. Throttle can go down to zero. Good. And I don't know how to turn off the... How do I turn the engine off? I, I don't know. I don't know. Open all the doors. There we go. Oh, that is epic, though. A lot of this is actually really cool. Uh, but at the same time, um, some of it's broken. But anyway, uh, I guess if you guys want to check this out, I'll link it down below as well. Uh, it needs a little bit more work done to it, but then it'll be cool. Um, but yeah, anyway, I'm going to go ahead and end this video here. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed the random different creations that we checked out today. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Um, again, if you guys want to use any of them, they'll all be linked down below. Anyway, thanks for watching. See you in the next one. Goodbye.